Hi everybody, welcome to Sport of the Week. Coming to you from Cougar Canyon School in North Delta. Of course, it's not every day that some of the young students here get to see a professional NFL player attend their school and talk to them about the sport. Such a case was Golden Tate when he came up here to talk to the young individuals at this school. Golden, this is a big, uh, big event to come to Canada. First off, welcome to Delta. Have you enjoyed yourself so far? Absolutely, I've had a great time. Well, what's this mean to you personally? Uh, just, it's, it's my way of giving back. Uh, get to, you know, hopefully encourage these kids to be active uh, and, and try to get 60 minutes of, of, you know, running around, whatever, and exercising. So, very, very important to me, and I'm, I'm glad I can be a part of it. You know, you've had a pretty good career so far, and albeit you're, you're still young, you're just starting it, but you've also uh, played at the professional, or you were drafted uh, by the baseball too. Yeah, yeah, I was, I was fortunate and blessed enough to be drafted out of high school in the 42nd round uh, by the Arizona Diamondbacks, and also, again, my rookie season. Um, by the San Francisco Giants in the 50th round. So and you decided that football was your calling? Yeah, I, I think football is uh, where my where my heart is. So uh, I'm gonna play that as long as I can, and you know maybe afterwards try baseball. Were mom and dad pushy parents, or were they ones that just said no, go and have fun and play whatever sport you want to play? I it was kind of my decision. Like I wanted to play everything. Anytime I watched, you know, football, baseball, basketball outside, I would want to go play. I never wanted to watch it. I just want to go play it. So. Uh, we had a big yard. Uh, my parents gave me a, you know, basketball goal for Christmas, and I just I would play all day, every day, until I got tired. And that's just how I grew up. We didn't have, we didn't really have the PlayStations and the Xboxes, and we had Sega and Nintendo. But those got boring after a while because you couldn't play online. When you were young and you watched the, any of the football games, who did you idolize? I love watching Deion Sanders. Uh, you know, being a Titans fan, I love I like Eddie George and Steve uh, and McNair. So. Those are, you know, the guys I watched. This is a nice event, bringing them up to uh, Delta, especially your school. Yeah. How did that happen? Uh, I entered a con. Well, actually, my dad entered a contest because he saw it on a commercial on an NFL game, and then all he had to do was go onto the site and uh, and enter my name, last name, and address, and phone number, and stuff like that. When they phoned you and said you won, or I know they got a hold of you by email, were you surprised? Yep. Did you believe it? Yep. What do you think, oh, this email is just spam, I don't believe him, but <laughs> now that you're here, you met him, is he a nice guy? Yeah. Big guy? Yep. Okay, so would you like to be an NFL football player one day? Yeah. What other sports do you play? Uh, soccer and baseball. Um, I totally agree that uh, everyone in Keenan's class was just, just ecstatic, and everyone at our house this morning, about 7.30, people were just sitting at the window just waiting for them to, to pull up. So Pulling him up uh, over here to the school in the limo, that's uh, extra special yeah. too. Well, we could hear him. We were walking down and we could hear them two blocks away chanting chanting for him and cheering. So it was uh, pretty pretty great for him. So George, big undertaking to bring this to Delta and in particular at the Cougar Canyon High School. We're excited. It's uh, one of four events that we're doing nationally as part of the Take a Player to School program in Canada. Uh, we're really proud of the actual partnership we have with Rogers Sportsnet and trying to help build awareness for the program. And we get to uh, do a glorified show and tell and work with some schools on delivering some key messages and encouraging kids to have a healthy, active lifestyle. Watch Golem go through the paces with the young people in the room, and, and you, the smile on his face says it all. Oh, you know, you know a guy that uh, enjoys what he does when you see that, and you know that uh, kids gravitate to people that actually come forward with positive energy, and you know, kids are intuitive; they can read right through it, and they're actually very supportive. You can tell. You never know; you might have the next NFL star here. <laughs> I think we already have one. I think he's just going to show his skills in the next little while, and then show it to the kids so that they can del deliver their skills. We've had a great time covering the event for the station and, of course, Cougar Canyon School. Very, very receptive to Golden Tate, everybody to come up with the NFL and everyone else involved in this big undertaking. Thanks for watching. Until next time, you don't play sports, at least for one.